Ta da 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 da, ta da 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 da. Here news music playing. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's Katya. Welcome to studio. And by this video, I'm opening the new rubric on my vlog called Fight News with Katya. Yes. So. Do you remember guys, when we were little and our childhood we all been dreaming to try ourselves in the role of news reporter? Yeah, and me too. And today I realized I actually have a YouTube channel and now I can do that. So yeah, I'm gonna be sharing this fighting news I'm following around or I'm interested in or I like. I'm not gonna be talking about like UFC fights or big fights or global news you all know already. I just want to try to share like something I like, something I'm personally interested in. It might be my friends fights or PTT's fights or just anything I've seen recently on the internet and I want to share with you guys because it's my blog here I can talk about whatever I want right? So yeah don't judge it very strict. I don't know how often I'm gonna do these videos, maybe every Sunday or if I'm busy or if I don't have news to share, maybe I just skip it. Okay, we will see how it goes and yeah, let me know if you like this video so then I'll try to make it more often. Okay, let's get started. So first is this absolutely crazy and incredible double knockout. You already seen, I'm sure, but I just can't not to talk about that. This was absolutely sick. Like, I've never seen anything like that. This video just went viral on the internet and this is like... Big punches now from Jonathan. Dorian looks in trouble here. Got Dorian pinned up against the ropes there. Good elbow from him. He's having to dig really deep here. Good oh! A, A double, double knockdown! knockdown! Unbelievable! Double knockdown! Who's going to get up here? Holy Is it going to be Dorian? Oh! Dorian's got on his face! Dorian's got yes! up! What a fight! Holy! <laughs> Unbelievable! Dorian wins! Wow! A double knockdown! In the slow motion here, but what a finish! The... Oh, that's yeah, left hook! Oh, the hook from Dorian, the elbow from... Jonathan there. And Max Muay Thai even saying that it's the first double knockout in the Muay Thai history, but it can't be true. Definitely it happened before. So it was Muay Thai fight between Dorian Price from the USA and Frenchman Jonathan Lickett or Lickett, I'm sorry if I spelled wrong. Jonathan landed a cracking right elbow while Price pounced with the right cross. It was Dorian that just had his wits up. Still can't believe it here in the stadium. Then the both guys got knocked out and it's insane. So basically who gets up get the win. And Price was the one who managed to get up and won the fight. Really impressive, really crazy and well done, congratulations. And the second piece of news is about my friend and PTT's head boxing coach Oli Don Sitsamirchai. Oli Don is a hero. <laughs> and he is a real superstar here in Thailand. He is one of the greatest Western boxers out of Thailand. Yes, he is a boxer, not a Thai boxer. And uh, he is former WBC world boxing champion. Uh, with seven title defenses and his boxing record is 65-1. Only one loss for the whole fighting career, that's insane. So he fought recently with an Indian man named Indrachit. I'm not sure about his name because I just got his name from Thai news and translated it on a Google translator, so it might be wrong. I'm sorry if so, but I just love to watch this video. Look at it, it's like... <laughs> ไปที่ศูนย์การค้าอยุธยาซิตี้พาร์คนะครับโอ้โหมาแรงมากเลยครับโอ้โหนักชกจากอินเดียครับอันดราจิตซิงครับไปกับโอเลดองซีพีเพ
ครับคู่ที่3ก็ยังคงเป็นเอาของดีครับมวยที่จะชิงแชมป์โลกในอนาคตอันใกล้นี้ครับโอเล่ดงซีพีเฟชมาร์ตตอนนี้ช้ำหมดเหมือนกันครับโอเล่ดงเอาละครับเดี๋ยวก็จะได้รู้แล้วครับว่าโอเล่ดงนะลงเลยครับลงเลยครับเจอของจริงเข้าไปแล้วครับอันตรจิตสิงไม่ไหวแล้วครับมาโดนถล่มก่อนนี่ครับชูกำปั้นโอเลดงนะครับซีพีเฟสมาดก็ชนะแค่ยกหนึ่งโอเลดงเขาเป็นมาชีนยูโน่เขาจบทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุกทุก Keep calm, you know he doesn't give a shit. And then a couple of seconds later, just kills him. Babam, so easy. Yeah, it was a really short fight, like two minutes or whatever. And the third news about my friend uh, Sandra from Sweden, who performed a really bloody war recently at Bangla Boxing Stadium. Sandra is a twice a national Swedish champion, 48 kilos, and she fought here in Thailand with a very experienced and famous over here, very good opponent, Marcelo Baiton from Costa Rica. She is much more experienced fighter than Sandra. She is WBC world champion and she got about 60-70 fights, which is way a lot. And Sandra just did so well. This was great, entertaining fight and I just went crazy. I was like, ah, Sandra, yeah! Like, it was so bloody, so many elbows, so much pressure and aggression and good technique. And she was controlling the fight all five rounds. Really great job, congratulations. Let's watch some highlights from here. <laughs> This is so enjoyable. Okay, next one I want to show you some madness from my friend and coach Letsila. He's a Muay Thai legend. He's an insane fighter, many times world champion. I even don't want to tell all his titles now because it doesn't make sense. I speak about him in almost every video and yeah, if you don't know Letsila, just Google. He's really super great. He's a hero, he's a legend. He's my role model. <laughs> He's one of the greatest fighters I know. So he's fighting next week on Tuesday uh, here in Phuket at the local small stadium called Ravai Stadium. And he's doing it for charity with no money paid because normally he fights in China or last time he fought in USA for Lions fight and of course he earns huge money for his fight. And normally he doesn't even fight in Thailand anymore because he fought he fought way too much before. Uh, now he just fights for fun and for really big money. So now he's helping to his friend and fighting here in Phuket for free. This is great opportunity for everybody who is over here in Phuket. Come down to Ravai and see the living legend. And see what the madness he just did recently at training. It's so entertaining to watch. And I'm sure none of you can do the same. I 
want to show you some pieces of fight of my friend named Risky and uh, his nickname is Kim Kong. <laughs> what? Kim Kong? This is insane. Guy with a body smaller than me named Kim Kong? What? <laughs> First, I was like literally shocked. He's from Indonesia, but he is a great guy. First, I thought he's just like, like crazy, like literally psychologically crazy. But then, like I get to know him, and he's really cool. He has a great, uh, very good heart. He's a super nice guy, and and now I love him. He's a good friend of mine. So yeah, he fought at Banga Stadium, Elsa, and he has this a little bit crazy fighting style. You know, like when he dropped his hands down. <laughs> probably thinks he's Led Silla, but he's not. <laughs> and he got really hard uh, knockdown by head kick, um, but he managed to get up luckily, and it happened to me too in one of my fights, you know, so I was taking video, and during the break I just ran to him in the corner, <sighs> And I was like, King Kong, now you can't win, we are points, because referee, he counted till 8, and this is basically what happened to me, and I lost my fight because I got count, and I was like, now you can win only by knockout, go for knockout, go for knockout, I went like crazy, he's like, yeah, yeah, okay, and like, he's not feeling good, you can tell, after this hard kick, and yeah, but then he did a great job, and uh, he went really hard on his opponent, and got a win! Okay guys, that's all news for today. Please let me know if you like this type of videos. I hope you do. Bye liking this video or commenting this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll see you all very very soon in the next episode of my vlog have a nice week everyone Bye.